In this Filmora 12 tutorial, I'll show you how to put text or add text behind an object or a person easily. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. Now, I've got a video right here on the timeline and it's just somebody walking. So I'll add it to the timeline. Let's actually uh, set that. And then uh, we can play it along to see how it feels. Looks good. Uh, I'll probably get it up to some particular position right there because I know there's a tree somewhere here. Uh, a tree may interfere with what we want to achieve. So we can actually cut this out and delete this section. Then let's zoom to fit. Let's go back home. And that is what our clip looks like. So these are our first clip. What we can do now is we can actually duplicate this particular clip uh, right here on the timeline. So actually lock this. Let's add it there and then bring it up. Uh, so what we can do now is uh, we have two clips right here on the timeline now. We have this clip and this clip. What we want with this clip is we want to use the smart cutout feature to remove the background right here. So what I'll do is I'll click on this and then go to the AI tools, smart cutout. And once I do that, it's going to give me this option. I'm going to draw it, draw over the person that I want uh, to remain and the background gone. So that person is going to be selected and you'll see that the selection looks really good. Next up, let's click to start smart cutout. It's going to process following and tracking as it moves a really, really awesome uh, kind of way. And then once it's done, there we go. Are we satisfied with that kind of motion? Let's click on save. And uh, everything is okay here. Click okay. So you may think nothing has happened, but something has happened. So this particular layer that I adjusted to have nothing, we're going to go get some text. And then we can go maybe to a default title here and put it there. The minute we put it there, we already have our texts behind this particular person. So the next thing we can do is maybe adjust it slightly. And then we can just double click on it to make changes. Uh, text behind object. It actually seems like we're typing right behind uh, this particular person. So you can actually put it that way and then maybe do this. Looks good. And then we can maybe change uh, the font to like impact and then increase the size 150. So I think it looks good. Play it. There's a text behind the person looking really, really good. Now it's up to you to be extremely creative with this. See what you can do. You can probably, let's just double click the text, maybe add some some animations to this, uh, but it seems okay. Let's see if we add that, we, we have any changes. Yeah, still you can add animations to it and the text still comes up in the background. It's really up to you to enrich your content uh, with uh, the tools that are available. You can see the different options here. Uh, we can do the typewriter and then click OK. Uh, we go back home, play, it's a typewriter kind of effect. Really, really awesome. But simply put, that is how you can put text or add text behind an object or a person in Filmora 12 using the Smart Cutout AI feature. Thank you so much for watching this video. Until next time, stay safe and never stop learning. Thanks for watching.